Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 190. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel, then click on my college website link, and you can download the workbook, Excel Magic Trick 185 to 202. Hey, in trick 190, we want to go from this, this is spit out from some database, we have first, middle, last, to this. We need to have uh, proper, capital, and then uh, lowercase, comma, and then the first name and middle initial. So let's see how to do that with a formula. Um, equals, and in essence, what we're going to do is we're going to take from the right this many characters, and then we'll ampersand a comma and ampersand, and then we'll do from the left, and we'll take uh, however many characters that period is. We had to notice that there's a period after each middle name. So that's a pattern we're notice that we're going to use in our formula. So we'll start with write. And write of what text? Well, this, comma, but how many? Since here it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Um, uh, down here it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 2. But one, and this one, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So we've got to create a clever way to always get the variable lengths. Well, what we'll do is we'll count the whole thing first, the whole string, len of that. And we'll subtract from it. Um, there's a function that will find a period. That's the pattern that we noticed. So we can exploit that if we subtract. Because uh, find will tell us the position. It'll count find will start from the beginning, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and say, oh, the period's at the 5 position. So we'll do find find what text. We can see our screen tip right here. We're going to say in quotes, period, in quotes, comma, within what text? This. Now, let's just do a little uh, investigating. Let's highlight this and we'll evaluate it with the F9 key. Oh, so it's 14 characters long. I'm going to control Z. And then let's look at this one, F9. Oh, that's 5. So 14. Uh, minus 5 will not quite do it because we, we, we need to subtract that extra space because the find found the period. Control Z. So we'll simply subtract one more. Now that'll give us, we'll close parentheses, that'll give us if we control enter um, the last name. And if we copy this down, we can see it works uh, with the variable length. So I'm going to click here in F2. Now we'll ampersand and then in quotes, comma, space, end quote. And then an ampersand. So we've just we've combined two things so far. Whatever the last name is using the right L length and fine, a comma. Now we need to do our left. And left will be much easier than the first one because we all we need to do is go one, two, three, four, five. So we'll say left uh, text and how many characters? I'm just going to copy this out since I'm lazy at typing in a bad typer anyway. Uh, control V close parentheses and control enter to put that in <clears throat> double click and send it down looks like it worked except for one thing we need to have uh, all of the um, capitals except for the first letter converted to lowercase so I'm gonna hit F2 and we simply put proper proper around the whole thing that's what proper does all it does is takes all of the letters makes them lowercase except for the first character in each uh, word. Now I'm going to control enter because notice I had them all highlighted. Control enter to populate all of them. And that is a formula way to go from this to this. All right, we'll see you next trick.